Remember that most important scientific paper of 2025 video? Well, we've got a follow-up. Harvard scientists led by Perez Mercator just answered the ultimate biological question. How did life actually begin? And they didn't just theorize about it. They created artificial cell-like systems that can metabolize, reproduce, and evolve. The details we call the essential features of being alive. This is the first time anyone has done anything like this, creating lifelike properties from completely lifeless materials. This experiment builds off the legendary 1952 Miller-Urey experiment where they recreated Earth's primordial soup conditions in a lab and managed to produce amino acids. Perez Mercator is essentially picking up where Miller and Urey left off with a scientific goal to figure out why life exists. Talk about deep. He worked out the mathematical equations for the basic physics and chemistry of biology, then used those equations as a recipe to synthesize artificial life. And it worked. They achieved something called polymerization-induced self-assembly. Very simply explained, chaotic nanoparticles suddenly and spontaneously organizing into structured objects. How do they do this? By using four non-biological but carbon-based molecules mixed in water in glass vials surrounded by green LED lights. And when those lights flashed on, chemistry magic happened. The molecules formed amphiphiles. One end loves water, the other repels it. Then these amphiphiles self-assembled into ball-like structures called micelles, which trapped fluid inside, mimicking early cells. The trapped fluid developed its own unique chemical composition, creating vesicles or fluid-filled sacs that were strangely cell-like. But here's where it gets nutso. These vesicles started reproducing. Some ejected amphiphiles like spores, others just burst open dramatically, and the loose fluid formed new generations of increasingly cell-like structures. But the fascinating part is that each new generation was slightly different from the last, with some variants proving better at survival and reproduction than others. These scientists just witnessed Darwinian evolution in real time from scratch. The takeaway, there's no divine intervention, no grand cosmic plan, just random chemical reactions accidentally stumbling into each other. Perez Mercator thinks this experiment shows us how life might have spontaneously emerged around 4 billion years ago from nothing but chemistry, physics, and really great timing. If you like science worth sharing, give us a follow.